And after that breaking news this morning, we know a teen is dead after shooting in Gallatin. Welcome to WSMB 4 News Today. I'm Alexandria Adams. We know that police are talking to a person of interest. Uh, Jordan James now live at the scene of the residencies of Gallatin. That's the apartment complex where this all went down. Jordan, do we know what led up to this shooting? Well, good morning, Alexandria. And talking with witnesses, they tell us that at least two people were breaking into vehicles here at the complex when someone came outside of one of the units and confronted them, leading to a shootout. Now, most of the action took place right down here, where you can see that there's a handful of officers still out here on the scene. In terms of what we're learning about the situation, we're told that there was an exchange of gunfire between the suspect and the victim, and the suspect managed to make it down the road where they collapsed and was taken to the hospital where they later died. Now, now, police have taken the accused shooter into custody and we're told that they are cooperating at this time. It's unclear if they will face any charges. And I can tell you that moments ago, we spoke with the mother of the accused shooter. She tells us that he was 20 years old and she said that he stepped up to try and confront the suspect after seeing that he was breaking into their neighbor's car. At this point in time, again, we're still working to find out if he's going to face any charges. But for